This morning for our series, The Dish, one of my favorites, we are visiting an award-winning Thai restaurant attracting diners all across New England. The restaurant is called Sap, and you can find it in the village of Randolph, Vermont. It is run by Chef Ni Sashan Ruing Morgan and her husband, Chef Steve Morgan. She recently won the title of Best Chef in the Northeast from the prestigious James Beard Foundation. Jan Crawford went to Vermont to find out what makes Sap so special. In this small town in central Vermont, on top of a hill in an historic Victorian home, is a revelation. Here in this tiny kitchen, with this well-worn stove, critically acclaimed chef Nisa Sean Room Morgan is creating some of the best Thai food in America. Fish sauce? Her kitchen staff totals one, husband and co-chef Steve Morgan. When you come into this restaurant, you're cooking and you're the line cook. Yeah, we cook together. You're the boss in the kitchen. <laughs> every ingredient Room selects for its authenticity. Every dish she makes to order, skills she learned cooking in restaurants in Bangkok. She and Morgan met online more than a decade ago, connecting over their shared love of food. To be together, Room moved a world away. It must have been hard at first to settle here. I like, but I don't like cold, you know? Right, right. You I like mean, Vermont, but not the cold. Yeah, yeah. I don't like cold, but I like here, I like, you know. You've built a life here. Yeah. Blending their families, cooking the foods Rung loved was also her connection to home and then inspiration. I was like, honey, you should open your own restaurant. I think we would do well, and if you cook food from home, people will travel here for it. So how did you feel about having a restaurant? I'm happy, you know. I don't have to thinking about I work for somebody, you know. You work for yourself now, not for somebody yeah. else. Need not to solve the distinctive flavors and dishes are inspired by food Rung made and ate growing up in the Isan region in northern Thailand. It was there during a visit the couple came up with the restaurant's name. We were sitting up in her mom's house, probably 13 of us sitting around a table eating, and everybody was saying, Sap, Sap Lai. Sap Sap. When we eat food together with family, all did Sap, all did Sap. And what does it mean? I mean, alloy, alloy. In, alloy in Thai. Yeah, alloy uh, Thai. Delicious. Yeah, that's delicious. So sap in Isan uh -huh. means delicious. Uh -huh. And that's the name of this restaurant. Yeah. But it also means something in Vermont, you know, because there's syrup, right. sap everywhere. Right. Making maple syrup from sap. And so it made sense. There's no maple syrup at SAP. All the dishes, the stir fries, seafood, salads, and soups are authentic to Rung's region of Thailand, with a few additions, because Rung insisted that's what Americans would want. I never cook pad si eel, pad thai. So some of the things that we think of here in America as being Thai food is not at all the kind of food that you grew up with. No, no pad thai. No. We what? fought a little bit at the beginning. You fought at the beginning? Because I was like, we're not going to have pad thai on the menu. Oh, you wanted it to be more authentic. Yeah. So I, I you're like, no pad thai, none of these Americanized dishes. Right. But you said, we want dishes Americans want to eat. I think yeah. because, yeah, exactly. because I think American people love pad thai. But I want this to be my last meal when I die. <laughs> Bruce Johnson told us he's eaten at SAP more than 100 times, driving almost an hour each way. How's it different than a Thai restaurant? It's not only home-style cooking, but she cooks with what she has. Rung's talents now have taken her places she never could have imagined. Nisha Chan Mono! Tell me when you got nominated for the James Beard Award. Did you ever think you would win? James Beard, I don't know, you know. I don't know how big, how that. Now so you I, didn't realize it? Yeah, I, I, I don't know. But my husband said, oh, big, 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 big. <laughs> Nisha Chong Morgan. Oh, you won. You won. <laughs> my husband <laughs> cried. He yeah, cried. Yeah. <laughs> she is the first person in Vermont to win Best Chef in the Northeast. The award validated her belief, if you cook what you love, people will come. You've totally improved on everything. <laughs> <laughs> you think it's familiar and then you taste and you're like, I've never tasted anything like that before. Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah. It's delicious. It's sap. Yeah. It's sap. Yeah. It's sap. <laughs> For CBS Mornings, I'm Jan Crawford in Randolph, Vermont. Where you'd expect to find it, but sap means delicious, and that food certainly looks delicious. Best new chef in the Northeast. Big honor. 
You're watching CBS Mornings. We'll be right back.